Dang, she's getting sold off. Hi guys, I need a coffee. That sounds good. I could do with a coffee. Just to get ready with me. I say not full glam, but I'm gonna use my full glam foundation. I'll mix it in with like my normal one, it's fine. So I got a parcel. That was good timing. Not, and then my dog won't stop barking. Great. So if you hear my dog barking, ignore her because she just doesn't, she doesn't stop. She doesn't stop. The primer, I'm gonna use the Hangover. I hope everybody makes that joke, it might even funny. Hangover RX Primer by Too Faced. Don't ask me why I'm using this because I'm not even going anywhere. Do I need to straighten this bit in my hair? Oh. <laughs> Foundation is where's my good bottle? What a beauty! I went to a festival and all of it rubbed off. And I'm gonna mix it with the True Match foundation. Why do I always forget to wash my beauty blender? Wash wet. Should we go in with it dry? Uh, it's gonna cringe me out. Do I have spray? What is this? Revolution Super Size Pro Concealer. So, obviously, with all this lockdown, with all this lockdown, whatever, going on, I'm just getting everyone at work. Like, like the most rude and disrespectful people ever are just coming out of their shell. And all the nice ones have just gone into hibernation, it seems like. I had a guy at work and he came up to me and he was like, he had like a do it yourself lottery ticket where you like just tick off the ones that you want and then we put it in the machine and it like it goes through and like it prints our ticket and then we give it to him. And it was an old ticket that he gave me, a thing that he, he obviously uses them numbers all the time so he like just gets them every single time, you know, hoping he'll win. And he came up and he was like, oh, can I have a, can I have this? And then would you also print me off like, two more like lucky dips which are random numbers so I was like yeah I took it from him and then did it and then I was like oh total's 50 pounds he was like 50 pounds how does that work out it should only be 40 so I was like well no it should be 50 and he was like right well that's wrong and I said no <laughs> so I read him off the screen everything that he bought and like he had uh, the the ticket that he gave me it was 20 pounds and he knows it was £20 because he uses that all the time because it was an old ticket and he had it in this little, like, little precious book for it and you could, you could just tell that he, he had it for ages and he was like, oh, it's only supposed to be 10 this, it should only be 10 and I was like, no, it's 20 and then he was like, well, it's always been 10 I was like, calm down and then the girl, like the kind of like the boss girl like was stood next to me and she was heard and she came over and she was like what's the problem and he was like oh well she's just saying that this is 20 quid when it should only be 10 and she was like oh do you want me to have a check for you and he was like no 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 it doesn't matter and she was like well i can check for you and he was like no i'll just pay it i'll just pay it i was thinking first of all 20 quid for a lottery ticket is you know a lot of money so you'd think that if you know, it wasn't meant to be 20 quid and it was 10 quid that you'd be doing everything that you could to make sure that that was down to 10 quid, do you know what I mean? Cause you just wouldn't spend an extra 10 quid on a lottery ticket, when you, do you know what I mean? Like, it's just, just idiots. I just thought, I'm not stupid. I might look young, but I am not stupid. So, he paid his 50 quid and he paid his 20 quid for that lottery ticket. I have this, like, old, <laughs> uh, I don't even think I can show you that. I'll show you the bottom, that's fine dream blush thing from Maybelline cream brush you know one of them things that you steal from your mum like makeup bag and she's probably had it like 10 years and then like you stole it good 10 years ago when you were like eight and like now you still have it and now cream brushes are a thing blushes brushes you know cream blushes are a thing so now I'm using it again even though I really don't want to know when she bought it I don't even think she'll know when she bought it but I took it <laughs> and then everybody with all this virus whatever coming around when it first was happening well, not first because first was like january but around like february i started wearing gloves at work you know just because obviously because i could 
so I was gonna and uh, you wouldn't believe like I got like 10 people come in to me like oh you're wearing gloves like oh you're trying not to catch this virus haha <laughs> like oh like you're really wearing gloves like are you that worried like oh it's not that bad I'm just thinking oh I just can't be asked because I can't be asked for people like that do you know what I mean I just said to them and I was like oh yeah 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 one of them pissed me off and was like why are you wearing gloves and not a mask and I'm just like do you know what I'm just trying my best to like not give this my nan and granddad do you know what I mean like if I was I'm all I'm doing is wearing gloves and I'm getting 10 million comments like if I started wearing masks like it would be like and I just I just can't be asked like I don't get paid enough to listen to them all this is went on and then about two weeks later the exact same people the exact same people that were coming in the store being like ha ha you're wearing, you're wearing gloves all wearing gloves half of them in masks like being like in and out like saying this far away from people like not joking around and i just think you just you just dickheads you know what i mean like if you would have done that two three weeks earlier and took it for how serious it actually was like you know people in your family probably wouldn't have it like people down the road wouldn't have it like it wouldn't be this massive as bad as it is right now do you know what i mean i just think you're just idiots i just can't be bothered like i get people like that in my job all the time <sighs> god knows what goes through people say anyway do a bit of contour not a lot just with the hula normal you know what i mean I've not contoured my nose. That is so weird. I never forget to contour my nose. That's just super freaked me out. Oh my god. That's usually like the first thing I want to do. Probably because I'm not being wearing makeup. So I forgot my potential. <laughs> I don't have any potential. I don't know what I'm on about. Like, look at that compared to that. I'm sorry. I always get compliments. Everyone's always like, oh, like, I really like your lips. Like, you've got really nice lips. I'm like, thanks. I just draw them on every day. Fake it till you make it. I need to start looking in the camera more. I'm sorry. I refuse to sh <laughs> I refuse to sharpen it anymore. So I just keep pushing pushing it down. And then wait for that to dry. Oh shut up. Why is my dog barking? <laughs> She's getting told off. No. Filming just takes so much longer than that, I think. Is it just me as the day has been going so fast for anyone else? Should I put earrings in? We don't want to. Where are my earrings? Where are my favourite earrings? I keep looking at myself, sorry. I should just turn my phone in the way. Alright, this is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, please make sure that you subscribe and like the video because I could do with it. My channel's a bit low, a bit small. <laughs> I'll see you in the next one.